Welcome to Headline News 24/7. Please click like and subscribe. Huge celeb is not afraid to die in his quest to take out Trump by all means necessary. Actor turned activist Tom Arnold is not afraid of dying in his quest to bring down President Donald Trump with his highly anticipated new TV series, The Hunt for the Trump Tapes. The True Lies star and former husband of controversial Trump supporting actress and comedian Roseanne Barr says former friend Trump will resign once he collates more evidence of his alleged wrongdoing. And Arnold, 59, tells Daily Mail that he will not be put off by the menace of multi-million dollar lawsuits and death threats. Equally, he's not concerned that his Vice TV series could cause damage to his image, because, he says, I have a terrible reputation. The explosive upcoming show, which premieres on Tuesday, led to a fight after Arnold claims Apprentice producer Mark Burnett choked him at an Emmy party in Los Angeles on Sunday night. Arnold had been chasing Burnett for months in attempt to get tapes that he believes show Trump making racial and derogatory comments while filming The Apprentice. Mark Burnett just went apes and choked me at this huge Emmy party then he ran away with his torn pink shirt and missing gold chain. I'm waiting for LAPD, wrote Arnold on Twitter after the fight. Multiple people who witnessed the fight told DailyMail.com that the two men were shoving one another but it was unclear who was started the altercation. Speaking to Daily Mail in the days before the fight, Arnold said he wasn't concerned for his safety because the people who get scared, they've quit. I'll quit when it's over. No, I'm not scared about my welfare. That's what they do. They threaten to sue you, kill you, or ruin your reputation, which I have a terrible reputation, no money, and I'm not afraid of dying obviously. So when Trump resigns, which will be soon, then I'll take it easy. Arnold's show, which follows his quest to find tapes of Trump using the N-word will also include interviews with Russian prostitutes linked to the infamous dossier by English spy Christopher Steele alleging unusual sex acts. Speaking at TV legend Ed Asner's sixth annual celebrity poker tournament raising funds for autism, in Los Angeles, Arnold added that Trump is out of his freaking mind and that he can't wait to show the world his findings on TV. Advertisement, story continues below. They are fixated because the most powerful man in the world is out of his freaking mind and it just so happens I have a show called The Hunt for the Trump Tapes and it just so happens that there are so many coincidences or things in my life that are in common with this guy, he explained. Arnold continued, when I have a lot of things in common with the President of the United States, you know he shouldn't be the President of the United States. Arnold reckons he has corroboration of Trump using the N-word during his time on The Celebrity Apprentice on NBC. That was the news. We thought you might be interested in knowing about this. Please click, like, and subscribe. Thank you.